Welcome back to the Biller Corner. In today's episode, we're going to be doing the top gift giving ideas for your fellow pool players. Now we've got a lot of exciting items today, so let's go ahead and start out from left to right. This right here is a set of magic racks. You get them for 8 ball, 9 ball, and 10 ball. And this would be ideal for the pool player looking to improve their breaks. Now what the magic rack does is that it prevents any gaps in the rack and makes racking and breaking a lot more consistent. Let's go ahead and move on to the chalks. Now there's a wide variety of chalks on the market today, but these are some of my favorites right here. This right here is the Tayem Pyro. Now the Tayem Pyro is known to be super grippy to prevent miscues and to be incredibly clean. At around $20 a piece, the Tayem Pyro isn't exactly cheap, but a lot of people believe it's worth the money. Now there is a new Tayom called the V10, so you might want to consider getting the newest version for your fellow pool player. Now if your fellow pool player is old school and you don't like any of the frills, go and give them a box of Masters Chalk. Masters is the industry standard and is used by pool players and pool halls all around the world because it's trusted and just gets the job done at an affordable price. Now if you're looking for a chalk that performs a little bit better than a Master Chalk, I would recommend the Predator 1080. The Predator 1080 is not too expensive, you get a box of these for around $10, and it's a lot grittier and goes on a tip easier than a Master Chalk. Now I would warn you, the Predator is a lot dirtier than a Master Chalk, so keep that in mind. Next is the Great White Chalk. Now when I did my testing for the chalk video, the Great White honestly really surprised me. It goes on a tip incredibly easy, probably one of the best out of all the chalks I've tested. So I would highly recommend if you're looking for a chalk to go on your phenolic tips. Now phenolic tips are notoriously known to be very difficult to chalk and the Great White is a solution for that. Next is the Kamui Roku. Now the Kamui Roku is higher end at around $30 a piece so it isn't cheap. But what it does do is that it performs very well. It really grips the cue ball preventing those missed cues and is incredibly clean just like the Tayan Pyro. The next gift is a signed cue ball by a pro player. You get these rather easily just by contacting the pro via Facebook or on their official website. This right here is signed by Shane Van Boning and Earl Strickland, two of my favorite players, and it's a really great gift to add for your pool collection. The next item is the Morikami Gator Grip. The Morikami Gator Grip is designed for layer tips, and what it does is that it simply just fluffs up the tip and takes off the glazing when you play a lot. Now this allows the chalk to adhere to the tip a lot easier and I would highly recommend it as opposed to a tip pick. Now what I've noticed that with normal tip picks or tip scuffers, it really destroys layer tips and decreases the life a lot. This right here really extends the life of your layer tip and it's a really great addition to the pool bag. If your fellow pool player has a really nice cue, I'd recommend some maintenance items like this very high quality cue wax. The next item would be a nice set of joint protectors. These are really great because they really protect the joints during transport which could be very vulnerable to damage. Now you get a set for your fellow pool players, say they got a predator cue, you get a matching set for them. Now the next item is a cue claw. This item is a must have. If your pool player doesn't have one of these, I would highly recommend you get one because these just go on the edge of the table and allows you to lean your cues without damaging them. Now a lot of players, they'll lean it on the table and sometimes they fall and they could really damage their cues that way. So a cue claw is a solution for that. Now these cue claws are pretty heavy and stout so it really prevents movement and they really grip on the table. Up next is a pool glove. This would be really useful for the user who has sweaty hands. And there's a wide variety of options like the Kamui. This right here is a more inexpensive Sir Joseph glove and works pretty decently and lasts a long time. Next on the list is one of my personal favorites, a new set of balls. Every guy wants a new set of balls. This right here is the Aramith Black Edition. Now if they don't like the strange colors like the Purple 5, you get a more traditional colored set by Aramith. But this would be a really great high quality option. Now these aren't cheap, but these will last a lifetime. Now if you get them a new set of balls, you want to make sure they're able to maintain them. Here's the Aramith Ball Cleaner and Aramith Ball Restorer for just that. Up next is the Balance Right Shorty Stick. This shorty stick is incredibly useful if you have a pool table in a home that doesn't quite fit. Now sometimes when I'm bridging on the rail, my standard length cue will hit the wall just because the pool table is a little bit large for my room, and this really alleviates that issue. Now this Balance Right is quite affordable and really high quality. Now if you want to get your pool player something extra special, I would recommend getting a cue. Now cues fall into four categories, a playing cue, break cue, jump cue, and shafts. Now if you want to get them a playing cue, at the entry level I would recommend a McDermott, Viking, or player's cue. But if you want to get something higher end, I would recommend a Mez, Predator, Peshawar, or Sean. Those would be really great options. If they already have a playing cue, I would recommend a break cue. This right here is a Greg Souter reverse taper break cue and has a very special butt. 
Now this butt allows you to choke up on it because of its special taper for those massive fall through for those easy and effortless breaks. Now since this cue isn't available anymore in its custom order, I would recommend the Meds Power Brake 2 because it follows a very similar design philosophy. Now the Meds Power Brake 2 is slightly shorter in length and allows you to choke up for that same powerful fall through. Now something that's a little bit more budget friendly is a jump cue. This right here is a Mez Air Shooter Jump Cue and has a very interesting design philosophy. A lot of weight is in the front of the cue because it uses a brass ferrule and allows the cue to do the work for you. Now this is a discontinued model so something that I would recommend is a Peshar Jump Cue because it's also very forward weighted, affordable and high quality. Now buying a whole cue could be a little bit risky because cues are pretty personal and you don't know whether they'll like the cue or not. So a little bit safer option is to buy just a shaft. Now you get a really nice high quality low deflection shaft. Something that I would recommend is the Richard Sue Tsunami Shaft. Now you could get a cue wood shaft like this from Pool Dog or custom order it from him. And this is a really nice high quality shaft that you get that offers lower deflection than your traditional maple shaft and has a very unique deep rich hit. Now if your pool player is into the latest and greatest, I would recommend a carbon fiber shaft. Now carbon fiber shaft is quite expensive around the $500 mark, but they honestly are pretty good because they're really low deflection. You keep them really clean and they're ding resistant. Now the carbon fiber shafts that I would recommend is the Mez Ignite and the Q-Tex Synergy because those are some of my favorites. And finally, one of the best gifts you could give is the gift of protection. In front of me are three Q cases. In the middle is a Q Master case that you get on Amazon. And these are relatively affordable and still offer a decent amount of protection. Now, if you want to give the best protection for your pool player, I would highly recommend a JB case. JB cases are honestly one of the best well-made cases in the market today. They have a special JB interior that's tight fitting and incredibly functional. Now, this is a JB rugged case, very basic, right around the $230 to $250 mark, depending how you option it. Now, if you want to go a little bit fancy, you get a special print design. This is a Lucky Dog design, and they have a wide variety of design options that you could choose from. All right, that's all the Christmas items I got for you guys today. I'm going to post all the links of the items seen here in the description below if you want to purchase anything. I'm also going to include a couple extra links of more affordable and budget-friendly options in case some of these items are a little bit too expensive. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays!